Donald Trump asserts that Democrats are targeting Catholics, highlighting a widespread fear that religious freedom is under siege and must be fiercely defended against political persecution. As a senator, she viciously attacked highly qualified judicial nominees simply because they were members of the Knights of Columbus, suggesting that their Catholic faith disqualified them from serving on the federal bench. And I'll tell you something. I don't know. We have a lot of Catholics in here. Probably not too many. How many Catholics do we have? Whoa, it's a lot. I don't know how a Catholic can vote for the Democrats because they're after the Catholics almost as much as they're after me. I would say I top you. I'm proud to admit. But they're really after the Catholics. Trump's statements resonate deeply with concerns about safeguarding religious liberty and protecting religious identities from political attacks. Many perceive the Democratic Party as antagonistic toward religious values, and Trump's words echo a sentiment that believers, particularly Catholics, are being persecuted for their faith. This underscores the crucial need for unwavering loyalty to religious communities and the urgent necessity to shield religious freedom from political threats.